Welcome to the Best Techie Weekend Wrap-Up for the week ending on Sunday, February 23rd. Here are this week's top stories. Facebook co-founder Mark Zuckerberg announced on his Facebook page that his company was buying WhatsApp, a cross-platform non-SMS messaging app that's gaining a million new users every day. According to reports, Facebook is ponying up a whopping $19 billion in cash and stock to buy the company. Google reportedly also put in a bid, albeit a smaller one. It would seem that Facebook wasn't interested in being outdone. We've gathered all the details about the acquisition in the full article on the site. The chairman of the Federal Communications Commission, Tom Wheeler, laid out several new proposals for network neutrality rules this week. Explicitly, he said the agency won't appeal court decisions ruling against net neutrality. Check out the full report to learn more about the legal tussle. A new report claims that Amazon's long-rumored, never-confirmed Android-powered video game console will be released sometime next month. If true, Amazon would be offering its consumers yet another way to consume its wide variety of digital content, all from the comfort of their couches. For everything we know about the rumored device, hit the link in the roundup. Finally, after a long stint of arguing over rights with a competing company, Microsoft has launched their new cloud storage service, OneDrive, which replaces the now-defunct SkyDrive service. OneDrive is everything SkyDrive was, so don't worry too much if you're an active user. To celebrate the launch, Microsoft published a new web interface for the service, and even gave away hundreds of gigabytes of free lifetime space to thousands of its users. There's quite a bit of detail to this announcement, so we recommend reading the full story in the link provided. That's all we have for you this week. Be sure to keep your browser locked at besttechie.com for the latest news and features in the world of tech, and join us next week for another weekend wrap-up. See you then.